Hello, dear viewer, and I am Lee Sass, and this, well, it's Viscera Cleanup Detail, and it's Shadow Warrior as well. Well, who? Oh, the dramatic music suddenly ended. Oh, it's starting again, okay. Um, <laughs> it's mostly Viscera Cleanup Detail, of course. So this is a special level that I've had for a while but haven't played. So I've had, um, I've had Viscera Cleanup Detail for a long time, obviously, and I've had... Uh, Shadow Warrior sitting in my Steam list of shame for absolutely ages, and I've finally been playing it. I've been playing quite a lot of it. I haven't quite finished it, but I've been playing quite a lot of it. But this is one of the free bonus things that you get with uh, that you can get with um, with Viscera Cleanup. They've they've worked with uh, luckily the people at the lovely people at Runestorm have got together with Flying Wild Hog at some point, and obviously said to each other, "Hey, you know what?" Your game you play, where the chap slices up the demons and makes a complete mess everywhere, we've got a, ga a game where you get some mug to clear all that mess up afterwards. So it sort of it sort of goes together rather well, doesn't it? Anyway, so I've been playing a lot of, of uh, Shadow Warrior and loving it a great deal. And I thought about doing a Let's Play of it, but... Um, I'm not very good. I, th I said I'm, I'm, I'm not very good at it. Well, I'm okay, but I'm not brilliant at it. So, and I, I think I feel a little embarrassed uploading uploading my terrible attempts. So you'd probably be embarrassed to watch it. You'd, you'd probably say, get back to what you're good at, sir. Get back to, you know, making up silly stories and cleaning things. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm, rather than playing Shadow Warrior, I'm going to do some, some Viscera Shadow Warrior instead. I have a little look at the level before, so I know roughly what's going on. But, um... Anyway, Zilla Enterprise demands that the temple be sanitised from top to bottom without delay. Failure to have the area clean prior to inspection time will result in immediate termination. By taking this job, you agree to complete and mandatory silence. Dishonouring the company will not be tolerated. A blind eye sees no wrongs. Any valuables left about the temple must be reported to the head office immediately. Thanks. Awareness proceeds on. So here we are. Now, if you've seen my Visual Notes before. You've seen Visual Notes. You'll notice that there are a few differences. Forgetting the, uh, the, 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 the lovely Japanese decor and the, the blood, which is quite normal. That's my mop. It's got a different style to it. Which is rather cool, isn't it? What else have we got? Do, I, do my hands look any different? No, that, the sniff looks the same. Pretty much. Did it always say MacGyver on it? I think it... No, MacGyver. It did, did didn't it? Okay. There we go. So here we go. So this is... This is a bit of the first level, I think first temple. So I don't think unfortunately we've got any demon bodies lying around. Um, but we will have a lot of normal bodies after Lo Wang has been through and sliced the place up. And, and a whole lot of blood I'm sure as well. Uh, but the reason I've not moved yet is because um, rather than the usual viscera cleanup where all you get to listen to is, is me wittering on for hour upon hour while I clean stuff. This time we've got a little helper to, uh, to chip in every now and then. Let's see if we can get him to say something. Hold on a second. Let's go and find something. So this is the first level of the temple. is like a, it's like a, it's someone's house. But it's like a museum. Absolutely beautiful. The things in here. And normally you can smash the place up. Ooh, there we go. There's a noise. We smash the place up, but um, now we can only clean it. Let's find something to pick up. That usually starts it off. Hold on. I. Clean again. <laughs> I haven't heard all these phrases yet. This is um I think it's voiced by the same person who does Lo Wang, who is the the character, the main character of um of Shadow Warrior. By the way, this isn't the original Shadow Warrior, of course, it's the twenty thirteen remake by um which is the first one was more like a I don't know, after I played it, it's more, more, more like Duke Nukem Doom type thing, isn't it? Anyway, but he'll chip in as we as we do things all the way through. Let's get him to pick up this sword, hold on. Look sharp. Exactly. So to ver you'll say various things throughout the level um, as we pick stuff up, which I, I like the idea of, and it might cause me to pause a little while as well. Oh dear. And uh, not jabber like I do non constantly normally. I'll be uh, let waiting to see what he's going to say, because I say I haven't heard all his phrases yet. Yes, so there'll be the usual mess. This is mostly, I think it's mostly one big room. Let's have a look at the back, though, see if there's anything else over here. Uh, these are the remains of the hench dudes who were... Uh, oh dear. And those are different faces. Well, they're not the usual viscera faces, are they? Let's have a look at it. Um, 
So I'm not quite sure how much of the uh, how much of the, the decor is taken from and, and the skins are taken from the game and how much from Viscera. Obviously things like this, this is very Viscera isn't it, and the buckets and everything, but these heads, they've been, they've used things, oh there's some money there, they've used things from the game which is very nice indeed. It, um, what else have we got in here? Another room? Well there's another room but it looks, oh, maybe we can get through here, it looked like it was locked off. That's one room, two rooms. Okay, still not too bad, it's quite spread out. Uh Oh dear. <laughs> this poor fella down here. Yeah, those are definitely skins from the game. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Is that another furnace? Have we got like a mirror thing going on here? What's going on here? I feel like I've got myself turned around. I think we've got two furnaces. How very odd. Um, two furnaces and two bucket dispensers. We have an upstairs. I was looking up here before the first time I played it, or well, first time I looked at the level rather, and um, it felt like there was nothing up there. But let's have a see. Yeah. Okay. Well, with the way it's split up, I think we can almost treat. Ooh. Unexpected. Uh, I think we can treat this two levels really, and. And, um... Oh, I've only got one box, though, I think. So this is two levels. I just sort of work our way around this one, and then go in there. That's like a plan, doesn't it? So let's get started and see what uh, Mr. Lo Wang has to say for himself. Hmm. Oh, dear, that smell makes me hungry. <laughs> Sicko. I don't hope you can hear that like money. Show me the money, very funny. Um, you know, I've already actually been told something. I don't know if I should do this. Uh, is the better bit to put it in there? I think so. I one of my uh, one of my chums has already told me. Uh, very naughty because I don't like spoilers. Oh, ninja style. <laughs> <laughs> is, that, is that? I don't suppose it's racist if you're actually uh, if you actually got the accent. It's, it's were made for walking. If I did an accent on it, I'd feel bad for doing it, but I guess if you're a... Uh, if that's your accent, you're an accent, I don't know. Um, he's gonna... obviously he's gonna butt in all the time now, isn't he, and interrupt me. Hey, do his nice shoes. <laughs> um, what was I gonna say? Yeah, so one of my... one of my... one of my jumps told me that I should collect the money and keep it, and there's a chief for doing that, because normally I'd probably be quite honest. What a waste of good steel. I know, I know, Lang Wang. Um, I'd probably be, would I be honest? I think I would be honest, but I will try and keep the money and we'll see what happens. If I don't get a perfect finish to the level, what's that? Oh, it's a bit of pot. Um, then, oh. never mind. And I'll know to blame if that happens. Uh, anyway. I'm getting nowhere. <laughs> you're easily, you're easily disheartened, low wing. Okay, so let me, let, as I start on this, let me make a few comments about the game as well, because you may know nothing about sign, about, um, about uh, Shadow Warrior, and I had no reason why I should assume that you do. Um, a lot of people obviously played it, a lot of people loved it, but I'm just going to assume that you don't know anything about it, because that's that's only fair. I think. So it's a uh, my decor. <laughs> it's a shush lad. It's ah, a th my brand new glove. It's a third person slash em up. Up. Oh! As opposed to a third person smash em up, which I'm what I'm doing. <laughs> And it's a uh, in it you play Lo Wang, who is a um, is he? he's a goon for hire, I guess. But he's an elite goon for hire. He's not just any old henchman. And he's been hired uh, by. Now I feel sick. <laughs> you have been hired by his boss. Well, got asked by his boss. Is that helping? Um, I can't think of it now. It's, it's going to go out of my head now. I won't be able to concentrate with this, this jabbering going on. Uh, his boss, Zilla, who's like a big industrialist or um, something similar, to get a sword. I'm guessing you were on the losing end of this battle. The <laughs> Novakuri Kage, which must be a magical sword of some sort. Lovang doesn't care. Is that money? It is. Is that money? 
looks like a folded set of notes. Am I just... I can't... I can't turn it. It's a... It is money, isn't it? Yeah. Put that in there. In, in, the, in, the, in there for safety. Yeah, so he's been hired to get this sword. One way or another. Ooh. Why did someone's chest with a tire in there? Yeah, so he's been hired to get the sword. From the, the, the gentleman who lives here. Who... I knew him. Nice guy. Who, um... Who, I can't turn him around. Who, uh... He's, he's goes in, he goes in with... Hold on. These kids with their guns. Goes in with two million hey. dollars. Goes in with two million dollars to try and... Oh. Can I turn you off, Low Wang? You, you, the, the appeal is starting to fade now. Um, he goes in with two million dollars to try and buy the sword. The chap here is... I can't remember the name so well. He refuses to. And he ends up with basically a sword fight because, as, you know, Lowbung is the kind of guy he'll get the job done one way or another, the other being um, slicing everybody up. But he's not a nice guy, he's, a bit, he's, not, he's not even really anti hero, I guess. He's, he's just a bad dude. He really is. I keep saying dude. I keep saying dude. But it's my kids. Blame the kids. And, uh, in the process, gets captured. Turns out that he's not the only person after this magical sword, supposedly. And before you know it, there's demons running around and chaos. In general. Sorry. Concentrate. And, um... Lo Wang, in an effort to survive, ends up making a deal with another demon. Called Hoji. Who becomes his little companion. A bit like a... A bit like a wise-cracking uh, navvy. And so they proceed to try and get the sword. While slicing their way through umpteen levels of demons. And everything else. And... So far, so... Blur. You know, it's a slash one. As far as that goes. But I think, the reason I enjoy it so much, apart from the... This. Apart from the slicing and the dicing, which is... Absolutely wonderful. Um... It's the interactions between Lo Wang and Hoji. I mean, it's this game does not take itself too seriously by any means whatsoever. I keep saying this game. You know I mean Shadow Warrior, as opposed to... Uh, well, I guess Visceral Clear doesn't take itself too seriously either, does it? Um, a second, I just realised where this music's coming from. That is ridiculously fucking interesting. <laughs> <laughs> Can I turn it off, though? Get laid in a minute. Oh. In the bag. Yes, the slashing and, and the and the and it, and it is mostly a slasher. I mean, you can use. I wonder how valuable this is. You can you can use other guns and things like that in here, but really the the, the fun is in slicing up demons. And literally, you, when when you can see the pieces here, the bits of body, that is what you can turn people into very very easily with the samurai sword. Just little pieces. And you've got complete control. It's not like you hit someone. I remember, I remember Total Biscuit doing a doing a review of this. And he said, "In there, it's not that you hit someone and they fall to pieces, like in many games. If you if you aim to slice off a leg and you hit them in the right place, is that thing going to shut up? Yes. Then you will you will actually slice their leg off, which is essential for some of the demons to deal with them to uh, deal with them as effectively as possible." And it's the interaction between uh, between Hoji and uh, Low Wang. Really and with a name like Low Wang, there are predictably huge numbers of jokes. Someone got medieval on his ass. <laughs> I see someone's butt. It is, isn't it? I think. Okay. <laughs> Good line. Um, I'm getting distracted now. That's the trouble. I should be quiet for a while. I'm sure you'd enjoy that as well. We're out of bins. Where's the bin dispenser? That's a bucket dispenser. Oh, there it is. Okay. That's good. I'm not doing this in a very organised manner. Don't go really. losing your head! <laughs> they don't take themselves too seriously. 
And uh, there are many, many jokes. There's jokes on the Wang line. There's jokes about how um, it's a clean cut. How uh, how well Low Wang might be doing from Hoji constantly take, making fun of him. There's all sorts of things. It is it, it isn't constant, but what there is is very amusing indeed. Sadly, that I can't play the game a bit better and do a, a let's play for you. I'm sure there, ah. I'm sure there are many better le let's plays out there. It's a nice pair of shoes that you could uh, you could watch instead if you wanted to. Yeah, I'm sort of hoping when I heard about Shadow Warrior, Mister Cleanup, I was sort of hoping they might have demon bits lying around, but um, but uh, it looks like it's only the first temple. But it seems like a reasonable, reasonably manageable job, I think. Doesn't look too bad. The lighting is a little old, though. I'm, I think I'm going to be missing this, if I'm not careful. Ooh, is that a... So a demon heart is part of the game, one of the items of the game. I guess he died of a broken heart. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, but that's... Uh, it gives you... It, the the, uh, the dialogue in this certainly gives you a good taste of what's up. Ah, nothing like the feeling of a warm gun. Like <laughs> what the like in the uh, in the game. Ah oh dear. Where are these idiots even aiming? That's how I feel actually when I'm shooting this game. I say there's always, there's more slashing than shooting, but I often find I'm not aiming. What sort of party was this? Particularly well most of the time. What I'm really hoping for, quite frankly, is a new Visceral level. That's what I'd really like to have. I know that the uh, the devs are busy with other things as well, that's part of the reason, I guess. It's a very strange shadow with the bucket there. Odd lighting. Yeah, I'll just say, the, odd, the lighting is a little odd. But it's making me think maybe that I'm going to miss things quite easily. It's that glass on the floor, is, isn't it? Tank Flicks looks like they're not the really large pieces we get in some of the levels of this room. Because they are a pain in the bum. Mostly because they don't fit in the bins very well. Yeah, waiting for a new level of um, this room to come out. And I don't really want to do redo, these, redo some of the old ones, I don't think. I don't think... I know I haven't done some of them. Oh, at least not done them, recorded them. But I don't think I'd enjoy them enough to to play them just to record them. Because some of them are a bit of a chore sometimes. Ah, Please. that's clean enough. <laughs> Very low standards, low wank. Oops. Another bin somewhere? Yeah, when I, I was particularly thinking of um, oh, it's got Zilla on there. Well, Zilla does appear to own. Whoops, that was a bit strange. It does appear to own an awful lot of different things. In the game, I keep seeing Zilla robotics boxes in the main Shadow Warrior game, and I haven't. Oh, was that the briefcase I came in with? I'm sure they won't notice. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on a second, can I carry this all the way over here? Where is it? There it is. Yeah, I guess it's my... I what happened to my briefcase that I had the two million dollars in? I guess it's... Um, this is part... I think it was taken off me when I was... Uh... Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. It sort of worked, though. Come on, do it again. No. Give it a kick. Get this thing out of the way. Oh, blah, blah. That was very strange. Ah, I think I know what's going on there. In some of the early versions of Viscera, I said, remember you could do some very odd things with. It's not safe to leave this lying around. You're right there, Wayne. I think you could do some very odd things with lifting things up that you were standing on. I wonder if this is built upon 
like it. I mean, this this let's this uh this level has been around for a while. It's not a new level by any means. Just like I haven't played it. Um, was that money I dropped? Did I drop some money around here? I thought I did. That'll turn up. Um, where's the briefcase gone? Where has the briefcase gone? <laughs> what strange thing have I done? Oh, it's it. No, it's here. Yes, it here it is. Yeah, yeah. You could do some very odd things with uh, with objects. So I, this, I remember this is probably built on an older version of. Don't do that. Just put it in the furnace. I'm sure, sure. There it is. Yeah, I think it's built on an older version of Viscera, and therefore some of the still, some of the strange bugs and things and eccentricities are still uh, around. 